guys, what's up? It's Stacy from Cloud9 Slimery, and I'm back here today with another YouTube video. So as you can tell by the title, it is a restock video for my restock, which is this Friday, May 7th at 3 p.m. EST. I'll go ahead and put some time zones here for you to convert if you need to. This restock hits very home for me. It is slimes that my mom kind of created, you know, and as you guys know with her passing, it's this restock means a lot to me, and I'm so glad that you guys are supporting me through this difficult time. I really hope you guys are excited for this restock. There are six brand new slimes, all named by her, and I just kind of made them into slime form. I'm also going to be throwing up here the restock list and deals for you to screenshot as well. I just hope you guys are super excited, and I hope you all love them, and I cannot wait for you to get your hands on them. This first slime is called Toasted S'more Shake. So basically, it is an interesting slime. So you got a thick and glossy base slime that is scented like s'mores, mainly kind of like a chocolate scent. You got a one ounce of chocolate syrup and a one ounce of a whipped cream, a bag of sprinkles, and a realistic cherry charm. So I really like the slime. It doesn't really affect the texture too much by adding all the other stuff into it, which I really like because you kind of still get that thick aspect. But the slime definitely inflates a ton, which you'll see at the end. And if you saw my Instagram story, it gets so fluffy, so puffy, and creates so many bubble pops. I really like it, and I think you guys will too. Next one is called Imagination. So I kind of thought of like rainbows when I think of imagination because imagination, you know, like if you remember that SpongeBob meme where he's like, imagination, you know, it's like a rainbow. So I figured it would come with some sort of like a rainbow looking charm and it's got so many bright neon sprinkles and glitters in it. Honestly, it's pretty. It's unscented. It's super clear. I just, I don't know. You guys can kind of like imagine whatever you think. I don't know. Am I weird for that? Probably. The next slime we have is called Tutti Fruity. So actually it's a candy. I'm not sure if she was inspired by the candy or something else, but I kind of go by the candy. So I figured I would do some sort of like mixing video for these um, because I didn't have them quite ready for the actual restocking video. So you're gonna be adding in all the beads. It's a microfoam with a bunch of other foam add-ins. It's also scented lightly of fruits. It's pretty light, that way you can still see the clearness of it, which I really like. It's going to come with some sprinkles in there too. I just haven't added them in yet um, and it's not in this video, but I am decided I'm going to put sprinkles in it of some sorts. And here's like a little mixing video for you guys to enjoy.
The next sign we have is purple marble. So my mom loved purple. I could you not, 90% of things in our house are purple. Anyways, so I decided to do a, the purple marble slime. So it comes with some purple add-ins. They kind of don't necessarily go with the theme of the slime, but they're purple, so I figured they fit. Basically, you're going to get um, a swirled slime that's dark purple, light purple, and white. May mix some in transit, so please be aware of that when purchasing. It's scented like cotton candy and blue raspberry. It smells really good and super sweet. It's a really nice puffy clay slime. It's actually very holdable, perfect for taking on the go or, you know, just something to fidget with whenever you're working. It smells really nice and I really like it and I think you guys will too. The next slime is called Coconut Cream Pie. This one's really awesome. So you get a little baggie of sprinkles and actually some, um, what do you call it? I can't even think of the name right now. I'm having a brain fart. Anyways, they are wax like pieces to kind of look like toasted coconut shavings. So this slime's interesting because you have three layers. You have a base layer, which is a crust, which they're all scented the same. They're all scented like coconut kind of cakey pie kind of thing, you know? But anyways, the bottom is a snow fizz and the middle layer is a cloud cream and the top layer to look like whipped cream is the like you know whipped cream butter slime topping it turns really nice it gets very sizzly and puffy and soft but like kind of crunchy it's like soft crunches it's really nice and very unique Lastly, we have lemon orange chiffon cake. So I've actually never had this dessert. I'm assuming maybe my mom has or she just liked the name. But it comes with a baggie of like orange and yellow glitters and um, sprinkles. It's very bright neon yellow and orange and turns into a really nice like orangey yellow neon color at the end. Get a little tiny whipped topping to top it off. It smells like orange and lemon cake. It smells really good. And it's just beautiful. Like people say that it looks kind of like a candy corn which yeah kind of kind of kinda, I kind of see it it's a little more neon but it's a cloud dough texture and then you get the whipped topping so it's very holdable perfect for beginners or someone who's not as used to slime because it's a cloud dough texture meaning it's it doesn't really get sticky
Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you're planning on purchasing anything. And if you do, I highly recommend as well as I really appreciate it because I know we're all just struggling. But anyways, thank you guys so much. I appreciate your kind words in my last video and probably in this one too. But make sure you go ahead and subscribe and like the video and I will see you all next time. Bye everyone.